Hi everyone, it's Jay here, and as always with reviews of mobile games from Mob.org. Let's go! 300 Spartans, also known as just 300. It was a beautifully crafted and bloody action movie, which was a thrill to watch on the big screen. Now we can go even further back in time to its beginning. 300 Spartans, Empire Blossoming. Ah, like a beautiful flower filled with blood. So let's meet 300, Rise of an Empire, Seize Your Glory. What genre did they choose for this game? A slasher. If anybody doesn't know, it is something like Devil May Cry. In principle, there are a lot of bad slashers out there, and rather often bad slashers are somehow just right for mobile devices. But in regards to our patient today, everything is, well, okay. The game dynamics are comprehensive, and the control system is quite smooth. The control system in principle is quite standard and intuitively clear for such a game. In the left bottom corner we have a joystick, and the action buttons are located in the bottom right corner. There are no combos, however there are special attacks. When you attack enemies, a scale fills under the life meter, and when it is filled up, you can activate a special attack by pushing the kick button, and a beautiful and cinematic action sequence happens in slow motion. You can even do the infamous THIS IS SPARTA kick this way. It does look pretty cool, but it's a pity that you have to wait until the stupid special attack scale is filled up to do it. Ah oh, well, probably wouldn't be as special if you could do it all the time, right? The graphics, as you can see, are also at a high level. For such a game on mobile devices, I'd say it's pretty silly to wish for something bigger. The quality of backgrounds, the animation, and the interaction of characters with each other. All this is made, for the most part, very well. Besides, there is at least some variety in the gameplay. Not a lot, mind you, but you can change it up from time to time. For example, there's a mission where you have to shoot at kamikazes with a bow, who are trying to sink your ship. At least it's not always the same tiring action sequences over and over again. I always thought that a variety of styles is advantageous in any game like this. But if we start talking about the levels though, it's time to talk about the only real minus of this game. It is very short. Damn short even. As soon as you get used to the control system and you start kicking the ass of everything that moves and start to get real satisfaction out of the process, the game comes to an end. And it is quite sad. This is Sparta? <laughs> Well, I hope there will be different add-ons, additional levels, really anything more would be nice. It would be that much better if there was just more to it. So to sum it up, it's quite a good game, very good even, but because it's so short, you just aren't given enough time to enjoy it. That's all for today. Put likes, follow, comment, you know the drill. This was Jay with Reviews from Mob.org. See you!